What did you think about the episode? I give the episode a solid 5 out of 10. Okay. Uh, I do think, okay, I do think Silo is best when we're exploring and learning new things. So in some respect, I enjoyed this episode quite a lot because I like exploring. I like the idea of exploring abandoned places and learning new things and seeing, oh, how can I piece these events together? So I was in, I was engaged the whole time. I really liked that. But there were some problems. One is the scenes were all dark. It's hard to see. Such a dark episode. <laughs> like, like yeah. what is it? The one episode of uh, Game, Game of, of Thrones. Thrones in season eight. Yeah. It was like, what? You know? And then a lot of Juliet's actions didn't make sense, especially given her mechanical background. It's like, what? what? So many mistakes. So while I was into it, because we're exploring and doing all these cool things, I was like, what? What are you doing, Juliet? Yep. The guy at the end was scary. But so overall, I did enjoy the exploration. Frustrated with a lot of the, her decisions. It was difficult to see. So overall, 5 out of 10. What do you think? I gave this episode a 4 out of 10. I didn't understand what the point of this episode was other than to show resilience, I guess. Yes. Um, the good part was that she solved the bridge puzzle because I, I was getting real frustrated. Like, 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 like Juliet, like, please solve this thing. Um, mm -hmm. And the con, I mean, the good part of this is that it showed her character. It showed her personality of this, this, like, you may not know what to do from the beginning, but you try, you try, you try, you iterate, you iterate, iterate until eventually you succeed. Um, the bad part of this is that it also showed a bit of her character and that she had some real, real bad ideas. Um, but maybe maybe that's part of it. Like, it's it's better to try and, and do something dumb and then get better at it. It's better to do that than to never try at all. So, I mean, uh, good, good, good spin, I guess. Um, it was also, it was, it was annoying at the end that when she, she finally makes her third bridge and it was a very video game moment. Like you go, you finish the final boss and then, or I guess you finish a mid-level boss. And then when you're going out of the dungeon, there's like, here's your perfect exit. Like here's, here's all the things you need. Like you, you couldn't do that before, but like, oh, it's hard they are. And it's very, I felt very video game. It was wild. It was wild that she thought that the plastic lashing would actually hold the bridge together. That really made it made me made me angry because if she's some brilliant genius engineer, then she should right away like stretch it a little bit. Like no chance. If I can pull this with my my fingertips, if I can, even if I can grab it with my hands and stretch it, it's no way it's going to hold my whole body weight, especially with the the additional leverages, the additional torques on the bridge. Like no chance. I don't know why she didn't make a rope swing. You know, like a kid's like like swing out into the river, or jump in the river. That would also have worked. It's like a simple solution, right? Right. Um, I guess I guess I don't know the point of the episode other than to show that she tried and tried and tried until she eventually succeeded, which is a good thing, but also reduces the Juliet lore of like brilliant genius engineer. Um, and then at the very end, the guy behind the behind the the bank vault door. He's like, oh, I want you to like go away, never come back here. But if you also don't want visitors, why are you playing music, which attracts people in the dead silence of an empty silo? Very strange. I don't understand it. Mix like very mixed message. Right, especially because he, we assume, saw her wandering around. Yeah. So go silent, silent running. Yeah. If like if it's Halloween and I'm out of candy, I turn off the lights, stop drawing people in. Yeah. But overall, still enjoying the series. Let's talk about it. 